Today we're going to do a quick video on how to do your inspections with an Omnitrack 5EG. Simply just click it. It should auto fill out your, your name, your vehicle name, and then if you have a trailer, you're going to want to enter that in. If you don't, you can remove it over here. We're just going to put in a random number. Next. From here you can select any of the options that it's a problem. If you don't have any problems, you got a quick no defect. Anything that's not descriptive here, you can have selected under other and type in what it is. And if you have no defects, once again, no defects. From here you have a last time to edit or change any of the defects that you may have selected. If you're all set, you're gonna hit submit VIR. I'm just going to ask you one more time. And, well, this unit's a little slower than most because it's an older model. And there we go. Simple as that. Now, let's go back here real quick. I'll show what happens when we remove a trailer. Hit next. This is going to be the only page we get. And also, if there's an issue, this is what happens. We're going to select the horn. Next, it's going to ask you what, what's wrong with it. We're going to put no beeps. And there we go. Now when we submit this, they're going to get this information. Yeah, it's a little slow. And there we go. And that is how you do a VIR on Omnitrax IVG.